What's going on guys, Freddy here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new GTA 5 video. And in this one, I'm buying and customizing the brand new Tampa. The Drift Tampa, sorry, not the Tampa. The Drift Tampa is so cool in my opinion, but it cost about a million dollars, just about on the spot, a little bit under. But uh, I think it's a very good cost for this car, because it's got some. it's got an awesome livery, it's got... It's really fun to drive, it's not like the fastest car in the world, but... It's awesome to drive. Sadly though, they put it in the sports car class instead of the muscle car class for some reason. But that's a whole different subject. But I think it'd be a great muscle car class, be great in the muscle car class because it isn't the fastest, but it's close to the fastest. So it'd be another very competitive car in that class. And um, uh, I'll show you in a segment. The, this livery is really awesome for for uh, one certain reason, but um. Here, I'm just doing all the performance upgrades, of course. Costs a lot of money. A lot of money. I didn't want to spend this money, really, because I was trying to save up because I was doing all these races, and I just got it all. It was kind of depressing losing it all, but it was worth it. The headlights look so cool with that cover over them. The, like, the cross, you know what I mean? I don't know, I think it's awesome. And I was just accidentally going, and I accidentally hit gold, and it looks beautiful. Look at this th car with uh, pure gold on it. And the thing I was think it's thinking that was very cool about this livery was like it's like a camo kind of. It kind of looks like a like stripes in a way, kind of like a tiger or something, but it's not because they're kind of random. But the there is like a cat on it, like a lion or something. I don't know. But it kind of looks like tiger stripes, in, in, uh, in my opinion. But it doesn't show up very well with the darker colors because they kind of they kind of phase it out. But I go with a gold because I just think the gold looks great. And now my car doesn't look like this anymore because I changed it after this video. But I changed the roof to black. But I put lime green on the roof to match the livery, and it looks all right. But I think it looks better with black. The gold looks so good, but that's a $50,000 paint job, which is crazy. So, um, look at this car with lime green on the secondary. It looks pretty good with lime green, surprisingly. Oh wait, I don't put lime green. What am I talking about? What am I saying? I put uh, I put race yellow, because that matches the race yellow thing. And that doesn't look that bad, in my opinion. Lime green would look pretty good as well. Turbo, $50,000 again. So much money just gone. I love the stock rims, but I wish I could change the color. You can buy a glitch with the iFruit app, but I don't want to go through all that crap. And these wheels also look really good on it too, so... I also get free chrome rims because I completed a heist finale like 50 times or something like that. Because you gotta grind them heist out, so uh... You get all this money, and... So I get these free supercar rims all the time, which is awesome, because those are pretty expensive, and it saves a lot of money whenever they're free. I was trying to figure out what window it was changing, because it doesn't even have any windows on the side, which is sad, because that would look awesome if those were blacked out windows right there. But I mean, it's kind of cool, I guess, seeing through them. See my character with his helmet on. I think this car looks so beautiful. I wish there were a couple more customizations, like maybe some like skirts and maybe we could change the things that go over the wheels those, uh, I forgot what those are called um, fenders and uh, a spoiler upgrade maybe and the engine block that's sticking out the um, the, uh, is it the carburetor? I don't even know the engine block that's sticking out I don't know anything about car and engines and stuff but uh, that'd be cool to change that and Oh, it's an intake. That's what it is. Gotcha. And then, I wish we could change a lot more stuff. Because they had so much potential to add more customization to this car, but they didn't. Well, it, I mean, it's okay, I guess, because driving it makes up for it. Because this thing is so worth the money It's the money it costs. I've been driving this thing like nonstop since I got it. But beware, I would not buy the new sports car. Not worth that amount of money at all. In my opinion, this is that expensive because the liveries, maybe. Because they think people will buy it because the liveries. But the liveries aren't even that good, number one. Number two, why would you even care about the liveries that much to buy 
to buy the car for that much money when it's that horrible. The performance is just awful. But I'm, that's just a rant about stupid Rockstar overpricing stuff. But this car is a... Uh, it's a hit. It's not a miss. This thing is perfect. Not perfect, but great. And they're supposed to come out with some more vehicles too, like the Contender and the Pegasus vehicle, the rally truck or whatever. So I'm really excited for those as well. Here I'm going to open all the doors and the hood and stuff so we can see everything. If there was a trunk, that'd be pretty cool, but there's not. But that's all right. And the grill of this car and the back, the very back, kind of look like the Sabre Turbo in my opinion. And there you can see the engine and the, the insides of the doors and the interior and stuff. Very cool car. You, do, you gotta do a burnout, right? The first nice little burnout in this car. I, I always put black tire smoke on my cars because I think it looks great. The interior is very nice. It has all the race upgrades and everything. The, the netting for the windows. And the engine block's not in the way whenever you're looking out the windshield. So that's pretty good. And overall, I'd say this car is great. Make sure you get it for yourself. If you liked the video, leave it a like, comment, and subscribe for more GTA videos like this one. It's been Freddy. Peace out.